All right, welcome into Five Reasons to Bet here with J Rod. I'm Ethan Skolnick. You can follow me at Ethan J Skolnick and at Five Reasons Sports. You can follow Jay Rodriguez at J Rod Show. Been a little bit of time, but we are back. We've actually got a new sponsor, and it's an awesome one. They're down in Miami. It's called City Cigar Lounge. Look at that. You're holding a cigar. You get lots of different cigars. They got Always. 50 different brands down there at City Cigar Lounge in Miami. They've also got great food. And yeah, you see the liquor there. They got more than 350 types of liquor. Go to City Cigar Lounge in downtown Miami. Tell them five reasons sent you. We're going to start doing some watch parties. So you got to check that out too, pre and post game as well. As soon as this COVID Best latest assortment outbreak. of whiskeys and bourbons that you're going to find in Miami. It is a phenomenal place. Yep. And here's the thing. If you lose a bet, you want to be drinking, right? If you win a bet, you want a cigar. So go check out City Cigar Lounge. Again, they do catering and everything else. They're right down in downtown Miami. Check out City Cigar Lounge. I'm getting hungry, man. I need some chips and yeah, guac yeah. and all that good stuff. They got the reviews. So check that place out. All right, we are back with a heat pick. Look, the Miami Heat, uh, we don't know who the hell's playing from night tonight. We know Jimmy Butler is not. They're still on this road trip. Still don't have Markeith Morris, even though he put the Google eyes up. I don't know what the heck that means. Uh, P.J. Tucker comes back. Max Struess is back. Kyle Lowry is back. Duncan Robinson's still out. As I mentioned, Butler's out. Deadman's not back yet either. But they're playing against a Portland team that has just been downright bad lately and doesn't have its superstar. So what do you think of tonight? That's the key. You remember that the the Keanu Reeves movie, The Replacements. This is yes. kind of what it, this is what it feels like, right? Um, listen, I guess the question is, what team is better? Who do you trust better in this kind of game, the Heat or the Blazers? And 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 tell you what, I know they're on a West Coast road trip, but I like betting teams early in their West Coast road trip. So this is Game Two of the West Coast is the best coast road trip. Miami lay in two. But the really stat, the stat that I like is that Portland gives up almost 119 points per uh-huh. game over the last 10 games. So I love the Heat over 109 points tonight. I yeah. like that a lot. I also like the Heat laying two. And listen, though the stat that I really like, Miami winning by six or more points, you're getting plus 140. There's wow. also another prop bet, the Blazers winning plus uh, over six or more. And then there's a third bet where it's any other result. As long as it's not by, as long as it's less than six, doesn't matter who wins, plus 190. So if you think wow. the game's going to be close, then go with the any other result uh, that's less than six points. Doesn't matter who wins, and you get that at plus 190. But I do like the Heat tonight. I like them to win straight up, and I like them over 109 points. Yeah, and they have played better without Jimmy Butler this season than last season. They've so had it, like gotten they used to it. Well, they've got it's unfortunate, of course, but I, I'm with you on the scoring too. I, I think even what we've seen from Kyle Guy and a couple of the guys that they brought in, Caleb Martin's playing as well. Uh, I don't even mention Bam at this stage because it's been so long, but I do think they have enough, as Eric Spolstra says, uh, to beat this Blazers team that just is just not very good this year. I mean, mm-hmm. it feels like Dame's mm-hmm. exit. And if you're going to bet it, by the way, I want to mention this: you go to BetUS.com, use the code five. BetUS.com, use the code five, you get 125 percent bonus. We got another sponsor here, and when we come back. From this ad from our friends over at Booze Bandage, we're going to do a couple of things. One, Kyrie is back. Really? Yeah. Would something change? And then we're going to go through some NBA odds here with J-Rod. But first, a word from Booze Bandage. Before you go to City Cigar Lounge, throw one of these on. Put it on there. All right, welcome back to Five Reasons to Bet. Again, get your booze bandages by using the code 5RSN. That's code 5RSN, and you get 20% off. And, of course, you can package a bunch of them together so you'll never run out of them. So if you really want to drink, 
Yeah, buy a big package. All right, let's get to it here. Uh, Kyrie Irving is back. Now, the laws have not changed in New York. He's still not vaccinated. Uh, I mean, we kind of thought that this would happen eventually. I mean, principle only goes so far, right, especially when it's misguided. Uh, what, what, what do you think here? What does this do with the Nets tonight? See, I think – I guess the, the question is what kind of conditioning – can he? How much is he going to play? How many minutes is he going to play? And will he disrupt what the Nets got going? The line, because Indiana's so terrible, the line is the Nets are laying eight and a half in this yeah. game, and the over under is two twenty four and a half. It went up. A, the over under went up a tick. The the side went down. It was the, the Nets. The Nets were laying nine. There's there's you know both teams are struggling. Nets have lost three in a row. Pacers have lost five in a row. Nets are clearly a better team, so mm. I think the win money line is not too good. It's minus four hundred for the Nets wow. uh, money line. But the question is, you look at Kyrie props. Like Kyrie props, nineteen and a half points. I, I guess I would think under because I don't know mm. how long is he going to play. The one that I'm looking at, and I've already made a bet, is assist because I think Kyrie's going to be more of a, of a facilitator tonight. Over three and a half assists. I like that at minus 110. You're not paying a lot of juice. And I, because I think Kyrie is going to be a facilitator, I love Durant. They're over 39 and a half points, rebounds, and assists all combined. And Harden, mm. same thing, points, rebounds, assists, over 41 and a half. I think they'll get that. Shoot, they may get that just in points, let yeah. alone with Kyrie dishing. So I, the, the real interesting is how long Kyrie is going to play before he runs out of gas. I love the over three and a half assists. In terms of laying, you know, the eight and a half, I'm going to stay away from that. It's too many points, too many variables with both teams struggling. All right. Give me one interesting thing. We're going to do more of these as we go forward. Okay. So I don't want to burn it all tonight. Give me one interesting thing you're seeing in the NBA props right now for the season. I think a lot of this is double doubles. You know, Jokic, you know, the guy gets a double double every night. So that's, that's a new sexy trend is betting double doubles. You know, you, you, you can you can make a lot of money on that. If you find a guy that's going to get – and, again, it doesn't have to be points and rebounds. Right. It could be points and assists. It could be points and turnovers. It could be rebounds and assists. Right. Double-doubles is the real moneymaker. It's the real sexy bet right now in the NBA. Yeah, and if you want to play that, talk about another of our sponsors of the 5 Reasons Sports Network. Go to Prize Picks. Use the code 5. Thanks mm -hmm. to our sponsors. City Cigar Lounge. you got to check the place out. It's awesome. Booze Bandage. Get one of those before you go to I City have a question Cigar for Lounge. you. At Bet, at Bet US, and at Price Picks. Yes, go ahead. Who's winning the NBA championship? Why don't we save that for the next episode? All right. All right. And you know what? I'll, I'll, give you a, I'll give you a quick advance. The Heat, the Lakers, and the Jazz all have the same odds. What? How the hell is that happening? All right. What? We're saving that for tomorrow. I feel like Dr. Dre. We'll talk to you tomorrow. <laughs>